Before we start, let me establish an example which we will be using throughout this video. So James has $100. He can buy anything he wants for $100 or below. He lists out his options in his order of preference. Number 1. Go out for food. 2. Go on a shopping spree. 3. Get tickets for the Euro. And 4. Buy his sister some clothes. So first off, we see that James can't buy everything he wanted because he was limited by his budget of $100. So James then has to choose one option. To help him make the decision, he ordered them according to his preference, which allowed him to choose going out for food. Economists believe people behave in a rational way. This means they make decisions based on a clear thought or reason. So the first economic assumption would be consumers aim to maximize benefit. Economists believe that consumers choose an option which will give them the greatest satisfaction. For example, James choosing to go out to eat will give him the greatest satisfaction. So if he uses his $100 to go out for food, he is behaving in a rational way. Economists assume all consumers behave in a rational way. They aim to maximize their benefit. But there are some times that consumers do not aim to maximize benefit. There are three possible reasons why. Sometimes the consumer may find it difficult to calculate the benefit since you cannot measure satisfaction. For example, how can James know that getting food will give him more satisfaction than going on a shopping spree? If a consumer gets used to buying a particular brand, even if another brand provides better value, they will stick to their brand. The final reason is that consumers are influenced by the behavior of others. For example, James might go to McDonald's to eat his food, not because he likes it but because his family and friends go there. The second economic assumption is that businesses aim to maximize profit. Business will always choose an option that gives them the best financial results. It is rational for the business owner to make decisions that bring in more money. Economists assume all businesses aim to maximize profit. But there are sometimes a business does not aim to maximize profit. Here are three reasons why. The performance of some businesses may be influenced by the behavior of other people in the organization rather than the owner. Business owners may delegate decision making to others who may have different objectives to those of the owners. Some producers have alternative business objectives. Although profit may be important to them, other issues may be important too. So, consequently, they focus on other objectives, making it not possible for the producer to maximize profit. Some commercial enterprises operate as charity. They are sometimes called non-profit organizations. Some examples include UNICEF. Another common reason why producers may not always maximize their profit and why consumers might not always maximize their benefit is that they do not have access to all the information available. So this could mean that a consumer might not know that a particular product can be purchased for a lower price in another location. So that consumer will not be able to maximize their benefit because they do not have the needed information. Well, that's all for today. If you preferred it instead of a whack in the face with your textbook, then like and consider subscribing.